Hi, welcome to this week's weekly vlog. Today is actually Tuesday. I didn't vlog anything yesterday just because we didn't really do anything and yeah, there wasn't anything worth vlogging. Obviously, I think it was yesterday we heard that we are now in another lockdown, which is great. However, apparently early, year, early years are still um, going to school. So that includes Alice because she's supposed to be starting nursery on Thursday. So I assume she's still going because they've not wrong to say that she's not going. So we'll see. But also my parents have said if she's going to nursery they don't want to look after the kids. Which is a bit of a nightmare because I need a break from Leo because Leo is hard work. So I just don't know what to do. Do I send Alice to nursery? Do I not send her to nursery so they can go to my parents? I don't know. I'll have to talk to the nursery I think and see what they say because maybe she might need the interaction and um she's already a bit behind with the speech and stuff so i'll have to see anyway today's plan is to tidy up i've got a delivery of a new storage unit so i'm putting that together so my plan is to tidy up lauren starts work at two he's here at the minute but yeah the plan is to tidy up the house today so i've just received a disney parcel this is just a couple of things that i bought in the sale because i thought i might as well spend my money that i got back for my Minnie Mouse main attraction items because I don't think I'm going to be able to re-buy them although I did manage to get the pins for £20 off someone on Facebook which was really nice of them still haven't got the mug but I don't think I'll be getting it so I bought these instead to cheer myself up so I'll open it and show you but it's got sellotape on it so I usually don't so I just need to get some scissors okay so I've just got the sellotape off it so now I can open it yeah, I'm not sure if that's a new box, I don't think I've seen that picture on it before. Okay. So, it's such a massive box for these three tiny items. <laughs> oh. Oh, I don't know if it's going to focus got the Fantasia watch. No, it's not focusing, is it? Yeah, so I got the Fantasia watch. This went down in the sale. I think it went down to like, how much was it originally? 20... 24? I, went, I think it went down to 16. And then I got an extra 10% off, so I got it for a really good price. And I think these are sold out now online, and I've never seen these in my Disney store, so it's really nice it'll go nice with my Fantasia hoodie and then I got some of the jewelry sets Lauren's got me the little mermaid one for Christmas I thought it was really nice so I got the Elsa one and the Rapunzel one I think these were originally 18 and they went down to £12.50 and then I got an extra 10% off them as well. Uh, these are still in stock, I think, if anyone wants them, they're still online. But yeah, that's what I got to cheer myself up since I didn't get my Minnie Mouse main attraction items. So my Argos delivery has arrived. I ordered a new hard drive because I have absolutely no space left of any of my hard drives. And I've got loads of um, videos on my phone and my camera that needs to come off for my... Um, vlogs so I needed a new hard drive so I've got a two terabyte one so hopefully that'll last me two years my other ones only last a year but they're one terabyte hopefully that'll last me two years and then here is the storage unit that's just come so once I've had my lunch I'll probably start putting this together so I've just made myself some pizzas I'm starving and then also I need to take this tree down because I totally forgot about it so this needs to come down as well today and put that away so I'm gonna eat this and then make a start okay so it's half 12 now I've just had my lunch and I'm now about to start putting this together so I'll probably do a time-lapse of me doing it so hopefully it won't take me too long to do
Hi, so it's now quarter past four. I've not got long till the kids come back. They come back at five. I need to start making the dinner at half four. So I've got 15 minutes to put my tree down. Um, I've tied it up a bit in there and in here. So as long as I can get the tree down, I'm quite happy with what I've got done today. Anyway, I just thought I'd show you what the room looks like. Now we've got the new storage unit up. Okay, this is the toy corner now. I think it looks neater. Let's see it better. There we go, just got all the toys in. So there's books in these two top ones, and this is just like a bit of the junk drawer. Just a lot of like junk bits and the little bouncy ball things in there. This has got all little figures in. That one down's got all the Disney little figures in. This has got their puppets in and some soft toys. That one's got all their night garden soft toys. This has got all the Disney soft toys. Um, oh, that's a Thomas. They've got her animators dolls in there. There's three dolls in there. This is all her other dolls, so like her Barbie dolls and her other little dolls. That one down there's got all the craft stuff in. Uh, that one down there's got like musical instruments and her doctor's set in. And then in front of that we've got the shopping trolley, these two ride-ons and the ice cream cart. And then up on top of the toy box her Barbie car, we've got the Thomas Lego car, Leo's little um, boat and tractor, and these are the little boat and the little house that Alice likes to put her trains in is on there as well. And then inside here is her Beauty and the Beast tea trolley because she's just broken it and she doesn't play with it properly so I'll put it in there till she can play with it properly. Maybe next year she might like to play with it a bit better so I'll put it away in there. Uh, building bricks are in there, my animator pencils are in there, um, the skittles are in there and their big um, like truck toys are in there and uh, her kitchen and then over here we've got her little shop so this one here has got all the wooden cars and trains in this one's got all her Paw Patrol cars in and the top wing one this has got all her Thomas trains and then an odd few of the little plastic cars. This has got all their Duplo bricks in. This one's got all their Peppa Pig toys in. This one is their Thomas track. This one's got all their Toy Story toys, so Rex, Bullseye, uh, Jesse, Buzz and the two Mr. Potato Head, Mr. and Mrs. Potato Head are also in there. There's also room for Woody when we finally get Woody. Well, we've got Woody, but Lawrence is keeping him. So I think he might give it to Leo this year. He's not sure for his birthday or for Christmas this year, he said. This is all their wooden train tracks. And then this is their um, Toot Toot Driver train tracks in there. And then here... It's just a few random bits where we didn't have anywhere else to put them. So they are there. So I think it looks a lot better, a lot tidier. I think it looks like we've got more space. I've moved the little seating area for them over there. Just I didn't like them being so close to the telly when they were there. So it's moved there because we've got a bit more space there now. Alice's this little potty which she still refuses to use properly. So, yeah, I just think it looks a bit neater now, a bit tidy and looks like they've got more space to play. So we come to in here, it is looking a little bit tidy, there's still a lot of work to do in here. So this is all still Christmas stuff that I need to put away. Uh, these are all my um, Kuposki boxes, which I don't want to throw away because I don't know. In case I do decide to sell them, I want the boxes. Um, so I don't know, I'll probably go under the stairs, but I also really want to take some photographs of the boxes for Instagram because they're so pretty. So I'm just keeping them there for now, but they're probably going to go under the stairs. This still needs sorting out, and I still need to take this tree down, so I need to do that. I've got 10 minutes when I need to start making the dinner. Take this tree down, and there's just random bits on my desk. So yeah, I'm going to take the tree down now, and then I'm going to make dinner. Look who's home. My parents decided to bring them back early. So I haven't got, oh, I'll just turn this down, it's a bit low. I haven't got any of dinner dinner done. So I'm hoping they'll just sit and watch this. 
he's lying down so I think he's tired Alice is making a snowman aren't you with mummy's cushions this is what she loves to do now she keeps making she calls them snowmen she told me it needed eyes has your snowman got eyes now uh, Alice can we sit down away from the telly that's a bit too close let's sit on the couch so they've already made a bit of a mess here Alice pulled this out straight away got all the balls I was throwing them around but it's not too bad it could have been a lot worse still looks relatively tidy just need to move the hoover right mummy's gonna go do the dinner you she gonna be good and watch this yeah you're gonna be a good boy good boy Leo Okay, so I'm just boiling potatoes, carrots at the minute, getting them soft. When they're soft, I'm going to remove half the water, then I'm going to add the corned beef. Sorry about the state of my oven. Lauren's cooked before and he didn't clean it. He always leaves it a mess, but I didn't clean it before I started because I was in a rush to get it done before the kids came back. And then they brought them back early anyway, so but yeah, that should be done in a minute. Okay, so I've now removed half of the water, put the corned beef in, I'm just going to give it a stir and then I'm going to add some gravy granules to it and hopefully it should be ready. Little ones are eating their dinner now and my dinner is just ready so I'm going to go and get my dinner now. Yeah. Keep turning this telly down, it keeps being really loud. Yeah, you're eating your dinner. That's a good boy, good girl. So I think I forgot to show you my dinner once it was done but this is my corned beef hash. Most people probably won't think it finds its appetite, but it's actually really tasty. Oh, it's just being really noisy. Probably tastes nice with a nice piece of crusty bread, but I haven't got any. But yeah, I'm enjoying it. It's nice. And it's something we don't have all the time, so. Although we have done it a few times just recently because we always seem to have carrots left over when we do our roast dinner. And this is a good way to use up the carrots, so that's why we tend to do it. Anyway, my internet seems to be down, which is really annoying. So, yeah, I was trying to watch some things on here, but can't now. Ooh. So, yeah, I'm going to finish eating this, and then I'll probably get back to you now once the kids are asleep. Hi, so it's now half eight. Alice is asleep, but this little boy is refusing to go to sleep. I don't know if you can see it. Alice is actually asleep in my bed because he was making so much noise. But he's just refusing to go to sleep. He's a little monkey, this one. He's usually asleep by now. So, just gonna leave him. If he starts crying, I'll have to go up, but I'll just leave him to mess about till he falls asleep, hopefully. Hi, today is Wednesday. It's currently three o'clock. Uh, sorry, not filmed anything this morning, but we've done very little this morning. Um, I'm just about to make the dinner, making chicken tricks of paella. I know we make it a lot, but it's our favourite. Um, so I'm making that. Lawrence has caught everything up for me because I hate, I hate chopping it up. It takes forever. It really kills my hands. So he's chopped it up for me. So I'm just about to cook it. Got a little man down there. So yeah, I'm going to do that. Then after dinner, we're going to bath the children because Alice has got her first day at nursery tomorrow. We were wondering if we should send her or not. Obviously with the lockdown and stuff. So yeah, like I was saying, we weren't sure if we should send her or not. Um, because my parents said they didn't want to have the children if she was going to nursery. And that means poor Leo isn't getting any stimulation of getting out and seeing other people. But however, it's saying that Lockwood and Duck could go on till the end of March. And that'll be three months with her not getting any education she's already behind other three-year-olds so i didn't want to fall even further behind so she's gonna go and i'm just gonna hopefully when she's at nursery do lots of stipulating things with leo like painting and baking and stuff and hopefully that'll keep him stimulated enough that he doesn't miss going to his grandparents house so we'll see we'll see how it goes but she is hopefully starting nursery tomorrow however they did say to maybe just send her for a couple of hours the first day because she cried the last time she went so we'll see we'll see how it goes but anyway i'm gonna start dinner and i'll get back to you when it's done hi 
Hi, so it is now six o'clock. Just run a bath, Alice and Leah. I'm just about to bring them up now so that she's nice and clean for her first day of nursery. So I'm gonna bring them up, put all the toys out for them. We have a nice bath. So we've just bathed the little ones. I've just put this little toy story nightlight on for him to look at because he loves it. Alice is actually still in the bath. Oh, she's wow. just gone out. But yeah, they love this little toy story thing. Hi, today is Thursday. It is nine o'clock. Just dropped Alice off at nursery and it was horrible. She was shaking, didn't want to go in. She was saying, Mama, no go. And she was crying. It was awful. I did not like it at all. I didn't even want to send her anyway, to be honest, with what's going on, but she's already behind and if she doesn't go she's gonna fall even more behind people so she has to go really and oh but yeah she just she's quite shy as well and she doesn't like changes and yeah she just was not happy she's used to being with me or with her grandparents she's never been left with anyone else so yeah it was quite quite scary for her I think she knew what was happening because she happened last time we took her she knew that she was getting left and I've been explaining to her all week but she just doesn't seem to listen or take it in so yeah she, as soon as we got to the door she was like no mama and started like sniveling sniffling so yeah the nursery said she's only going to stay for two hours she's supposed to stay for five hours but there's no way she'll stay for five hours so they said they're gonna ring if she gets too upset so let's hope that she calms down and she can at least last for two hours but Leah's having a great time aren't you because she's not here she's pl is playing Hello. so I'll probably get back to you now once we get Alice back so little Alice has just finished school today haven't you and she was a big brave girl wasn't you she didn't cry and she was a big brave girl and we're just going to walk home now aren't we we was going to walk through the park but it was blocked off where we were going to go wasn't it Oh yeah, we're just going home to see Daddy and Leah. Is it snowing? No, it's cold. I don't know if you can see, but it is snowing. It was snowing really heavily a minute ago and it stopped, didn't it? Wow, should we go back in now? You've seen it? Yeah, should we go back in? She's seen the snow. Go back in. So I've just received a parcel and I'm pretty sure it is the Minnie Mouse main attraction pins that I ordered off a lovely lady on Facebook. She sold them to me for £20 all in, so that included postage and PayPal fees, which I think is a really fair price for them. Um, so yeah, I don't know if you watched my previous vlogs, but my I ordered them when they were released on Disney Store and Herm's lost my parcel. I had ordered the plush, the mugs and the pins. Um, I did manage to get the plush when it went down in the sale, so I only paid £20 for that. Um, the mug, however, I um, so far haven't been able to get hold of because people are selling it for £40. Oh, that's nice, So yeah, as I was saying, they're selling the mug for like £35 to £40. And I just can't justify that on a mug that I originally paid £13.50 for. So I'm going to keep looking. I might have to wait like a year like I did with the uh, Mickey, the May Mickey that I really wanted. I waited a year and then was able to get it really cheap. So I might have to do that. Eventually I'll probably get end up with the mug. But anyway, let's open the pins. I'm really excited to see what they look like. <laughs> Oh wow, they are so pretty. There they are. I'm so happy to find have them. These are gorgeous. These are so nice. I just really wish I had the mug. I can't really put the plush on display without the mug because all the others have the mug. And I'm just I just 
cannot justify spending 35 to 40 pounds on a mug just can't do it so maybe one day they'll be put on display they're gonna go on display with my other pins anyway I just not put them on display yet but I'm gonna keep the backing card just in case I do end up getting them all gonna put them on display but they're really really nice pins I'm so happy so these are usually 14 pounds and then if you had to pay postage on top they would say 18 pounds um, when you buy things off people they have to pay PayPal fees so I think 20 pounds was a really fair price off the person I bought them from on Facebook so I'm really thankful for them to sell them for 20 pounds so there they are Alice is playing princesses Oh, he took her skirt off. Go away. Go away. I mean, crown. Oh, is she playing in the house? Crown. What's she doing? A crown. <laughs> Hasn't got a crown, is she? Here at is she gonna have another bath? Or is she all clean now? Oh, no, I'm getting on. They're not gone. I'm getting clean. Mama, put it on. It's her skirt, I think. I think it's like a skirt. Oh. She needs a bath. Oh, you have to get her friend out. Merida's is in the bath. Is her friend Merida in the bath. No. No. Yeah, I'll fix it. Wait a minute. Hi, today is Friday. We've actually been up really early this morning at six because. Alice starts nursery properly today as they're making lots of noise in the background so she actually starts at 8 o'clock so we had to get up at 6 today I got all the clothes out ready last night so everything's ready they've had the breakfast and I just need to get them dressed I think it's just gone 7 so we need to leave about uh, 22, 8 maybe to get there so yeah, I'm going to get them dressed and then we're all ready to go yeah, so last night I got all the clothes laid out so we're all ready just put them on i also made her lunch last night and then this has got all her other bits in that she needs for nursery so we're all set to go so alice is all ready for school now aren't you We've got a while yet we've still got about 20 minutes before we need to go but she's all ready she's just watching paw patrol now aren't you wait i'm all ready this little one's all dressed and ready but yeah, so just have a little relax and watching Paw Patrol while Daddy gets all ready. Hi, it's now quarter to nine. Alice has been dropped off at nursery. She got a little bit teary when she was in her pram saying she didn't want to get out. Once she got to the door, she did just take the lady's hand and went in. So fingers crossed she'll be okay today. We'll find out when we pick her up. We've just been playing with Leo, making a little track. Oh, we, Leo. And now he's going to play bubbles with Daddy. Daddy's going to put in him. Here's some bubbles. Wow! Bubbles, Leo! Leo, where's the bubbles? Ah! Catch them! Can Leo catch? <laughs> <laughs> that good? Catch! Good boy! <laughs> Where have they gone? <laughs> Good boy. So it's now about half twelve. I'm just getting ready to come pick Alice up from nursery. I hope she had a good time. They didn't ring me, say she was really upset to come get her, so that's a good sign. So we'll see what she says when I get there. So I'm gonna head off now and I'll let you know once we get back. We're just back from school. Alice was a good girl, they said, didn't you? Apparently she didn't eat her lunch. So let's get inside. Hi, so it is now, I think it's nearly 11 o'clock. The children actually went to sleep quite well today. Leah fell asleep at 7. Alice fell asleep at half 7. Leah's woken up once. Lawrence is back. We're both treating ourselves to hot chocolate because all the way through Christmas we forgot to make hot chocolates, didn't we? We kept saying we're going to make one and then the kids would wake yeah. up and... So this is the first hot chocolate I've had and it's freezing today so 
made ourselves nice hot chocolate it's all melted a bit now it's got cream and sprinkles and marshmallows and a candy cane Lawrence has got Baileys in his but I don't like Baileys Baileys dark chocolate <laughs> yeah. makes it pain us <laughs> so he's enjoying that so Alice did just wake up and we thought we were gonna both of them just woke up in a second ago didn't we have gone back to sleep yeah that probably wake up yeah, well, we both lay back down, so fingers crossed we at least get to drink these. I got food to eat. And he's got food to eat, so. But yeah, we're going to drink these, try and watch some telly, mm. and then head to bed. Hi, today is Saturday. Me and Alice are matching today, aren't we? She's yeah. got Tinkerbell top, and Mummy's got Tinkerbell top. We're all matching, aren't we? So. This little girl is just having a little snack, she's having some skips. She loves skips, don't you? There's having his nap. Her mummy is so tired. So tired. I was saying to Lawrence, I'm not sure how much longer I can go on getting no sleep because I'm just so tired all the time now. And the mummy's just always tired. Leo's a nightmare, but he's getting more teeth. I'm not sure how long this is gonna go on for, how long he's gonna be teething for, but I just can't cope with no more sleep. Daddy's alright because Daddy leaves me with both of them. She was in our bed again last night. Both of them in our bed. And Daddy comes and sleeps on the couch. Daddy gets sleep and Mummy gets no sleep. Oh, hey. Little princess. There's no school for Alice today because it's Saturday, isn't it? Are you going to go back to school next Where's week? Where's what gone? Where's what gone? Where's what gone? What did you say? Alice's favourite toys to play with at the moment <gasps> are her Paw Patrol toys. You love your Paw Patrol, don't you? Where's hat gone? Where's hat gone? <laughs> yeah, she loves playing with the Paw Patrol toys. She makes me play with them all the time, don't you? She yeah. goes, what do we say? They're all good pups. Yeah. And they save the day. Alice likes to say, save the day, don't you? She won't do it now, though, but usually she always goes, save the day. Don't you? Yeah? So, I'm not sure if I'm going to film anything today, because I'm so tired. I've not got any activities planned with the kids. I'm just, I'm just too tired. I'm just going to maybe play with them with the toys, read them some books today, and that's it. So, we'll see what I do tomorrow if I manage to get any sleep tonight or oh, not. Uh, Lawrence is not on as late a shift today. He's um, working a 10 7. Um, the rest of the week he's been doing 2 till 11, 2 till close. I think it closes at half 10. He's been getting home around 11. So, yeah, I'm so tired. Yeah, I think I'm going to let this little one watch a bit of telly. We've not had the telly on all morning because we've been playing, haven't we? And I'm so tired. Watch a bit of telly so I can have a rest. Now Leo's having a rest. Yesterday, after, uh, yesterday when she was at nursery and Leo had his nap, me and Lawrence both fell asleep on the couch because we were that tired. We both fell asleep. We had the baby monitor on, so if he cried, we'd wake up. But we had about an hour's sleep both of us, so we were just so tired. I just hope this teething finishes soon and it is just a TV that's keeping him awake because I can't go to sleep. Plus I have a bladder condition so I get up two to three times in the night with that also and then I struggle to get to sleep so that it takes me uh, at least half an hour to an hour to get back to sleep so I reckon I'm only getting two to three hours sleep a night if that so that's why I'm so tired. Yeah. You're loving them skips, aren't you? Hey, So, we we'll, might get back to you later, but it might be tomorrow. Hi, today is Sunday. I actually can't remember the last time I filmed this week. Did I film yesterday? I don't know, I can't remember. But yeah, they've just not been doing much this week. I'm so tired. Leo is a nightmare, but he's got a few teeth coming through at once, so yeah, he cries in pain. You can tell it's a pain cry when he's waking up and crying, and then he just fidgets and fidgets, so not been getting much sleep, so that's why I've not really been filming, because I've just been so, so tired. I also was really bad today and yesterday. I'd not really done the potty training with Alice. I shoved a nappy on her, just because I'm so tired. I haven't got the energy to do it, because like, she just wheezes everywhere. <laughs> 
Monday we're starting again, no more breaks. I, sh I shouldn't really have taken this little break, but I did. They did say it online that you shouldn't really be trying if they're just if something a big life event is happening. And obviously she's just started nursery this week, so we probably should have waited until after she started nursery. But we'll start again on Monday. Well, we misses, but she just doesn't seem to get it at all doesn't get it I have read some people say that their children were free and they didn't get it till they were three and a half so we'll see we'll keep trying won't we Alice hey she's just playing with her Paw Patrol toys those toys she plays with all day every day she absolutely loves those little little dogs in the little cars she loves them her dad even said he might buy her she's missing one of the pups not one of the main ones it's two that aren't main ones that's sometimes in it and she's missing i think it's called tracker she's not got that her dad even said he might buy it just because she's so cute playing with them <laughs> he said he might get it for it well i said to her said, said to her if she's a good girl and does wee wee's on the potty then she can get it but she didn't don't really understand did you no i'll show you where so she's got the pepper pig house it's a little paw patrol pups She's playing with them in the little mighty house. Pups. Yeah, they're mighty pups today, are they? Mighty pups. Yeah, they're mighty pups, aren't they, today? Train track. Train track. <laughs> oh. So she's having fun playing with that. I've just been playing with Leo. Look at the mess, it's an absolute mess. But me and Leo have just been playing. I've just put some nursery rhymes on for him for a little bit. Learn some colours and numbers and stuff. So we've just been doing that, haven't we, Leo? We've been reading his book. But I think I'm gonna let him sit and watch this on his own for a little bit now and I'm gonna do a bit of a bit of editing. So all the toys and figures this little one got for Christmas and she wants to play with staplers. This is the baby stapler or the little kid stapler. And then this is the daddy stapler. Bike out. Need to get that bike out. Okay, Mum will open the bike in a minute. But yeah, she's got all the Peppa Pig figures, Mickey and Minnie Mouse figures, princess figures. But no, she wants to play with the staplers. <laughs> Alright, wait a minute. Okay, this little boy loves Mummy's chair. You ready, Leo? Sit properly on it. He likes me when I spin it. I can't spin it unless you sit back. Whee! Whee! He just wants to chew everything. At oh, that's mummy's camera. He wants to chew everything at the minute. Just trying to find something he can chew. His teeth are killing them, aren't they? You've got teeth coming as mama's. Look, can you see Leo? Who's that? Is that Leo? Oh, Leo, isn't it? Uh uh, careful. Shall mommy spin you? Ready? One, two, three. Whee! <laughs> uh uh uh, ready? One, two, three. Whee! Good boy. Good boy. So it is three o'clock in the minute, isn't it? More? Say more. Can Leo say more? Say more. Hey, my camera. My camera. Yeah, yeah. yeah so it's three o'clock. I'm not going to start doing dinner ah, till four o'clock. I'm just going to have sausage and mash and veg today. <laughs> so, oh, right. I'm going to put the camera away because he just wants to play with it. <laughs> Hi, so it is now six o'clock. Lawrence is home. The kids have had their dinner. I'm having my dinner. That Lawrence is watching the kids now so I can have a nice relaxing bath and he bought me a little treat from his work he got me a nice bath pillow I've been wanting a bath pillow for ages so I'm gonna enjoy this bath I've got myself a nice um, let me see, lush bath bomb so yeah I'm gonna enjoy my bath and then I will get back to you later once the kids are in bed
Hi, so it's now eight o'clock. I've had a bath. I feel much more refreshed now. Both kids are asleep in bed. Lawrence has actually just gone up for his bath. And I'm hoping once he's finished in the bath, we're going to watch some telly and hopefully play our Disney colouring game. That's the plan. We'll see what time he gets out of the bath because he likes to have long baths. But I thought since he's in the bath, I'm going to do a bit of editing, trying desperately to catch up with my vlogs. I'm nearly there. I just really want to be hopefully caught up by the end of January. Fingers crossed. So yeah, I'm going to get on with some editing and I'll get back to you once Lawrence is out of the bath. Hi, so I've just been editing the vlog and realised that I never actually finished this week's vlog. Um, so yeah, we didn't actually do much once Lawrence got out of the bath. I think we just watched a bit of telly. We didn't end up playing the colour brain game. We didn't have time. Um, but yeah, I hope you have enjoyed this week's weekly vlog. I know we didn't do too much this week. But I think this is probably going to be what most of the vlogs are going to be like now we're in lockdown. Um, so hopefully they'll still be fun for you. Um, it's just going to be a bit shorter, which I think some people prefer anyway. I know mine are usually quite long vlogs, so hopefully they'll be a bit shorter now. So yeah, I hope you have enjoyed this week's weekly vlog. If you have, please give it a like. Don't forget to subscribe and hope to see you again soon. Bye.